Hello, hello there. Welcome back to the channel, guys. So right now it is, yo, I can't even tell the time, but it's almost 3 a.m. We, what is the time? Three o'clock. Yeah. So as you can see, the busy setting up uh, the Christmas market here next to the Basilica in Budapest. Now we're just like going to take the bus to so that we can go get the airport bus and be on our way. So yeah, keep you guys posted. I got you. I need an iPhone 13 Pro Max. I know I'm the iPhone 13 Pro Max. <laughs> Yo guys, yet again I'm back here with another person that doesn't have MasterCard launch access. Now we have to leave. Oh, I almost did this. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> I can't even go in here. I, I I really need to like upgrade my circle. As you can see, we was flying here yeah, to Dublin in Republic of Ireland, not Northern Ireland, which is part of the UK. So Republic of Ireland is not a Schengen state. So if you are a resident in Europe or if you are here on a Schengen visa, it's very likely that you'll need a separate visa for if you decide to go here unless you are South African or come from a country that also has a visa-free agreement with Ireland. Because yes, you heard that right. If you are South African, you do not need a visa to go to Republic of Ireland. So right now we are just in the sexy rank. There's a motor there that says God is love. So this neighborhood reminds me so much of like these um some of these British shows you you'd see like on BBC, like whenever they are interviewing families for like different things. Okay, so finally got off the bus. Now just walk into our Airbnb. So this is like the neighborhood. It's really not, it's like very quaint and quiet. Actually quaint means quiet. What am I saying? <laughs> yeah, it's very quaint. Um, yeah, like it looks very residential. And I'm just gonna go there, fresh up a wee bit. So this is it. Uh, so we just checked into Airbnb. Um, so I'm just gonna quickly take you guys around, yeah? Should I wait for the I mean, yeah, you gotta mess it up. <laughs> oh, there's even like a full body mirror thing here. Where you can like check yourself in and whatnot. Hey, Jama Tonna didn't know what did I say. It's really standard. Um, yeah, there's like a little sitting area here. <laughs> <laughs> this is a braid, yeah. So they give you free braid here. Um, okay, I don't even know if that is a TV or a monitor or if, if it even works. Just with what? TV? Okay, I don't know. Um, so you get like a. Sorry? But <laughs> not. So you get like a little kitchenette. Um, yeah, with like the essentials. Oh my god. <laughs> Why is this bread so, so thick though? Um, yeah, I like it's pretty standard. What else is in here? This is the bathroom. Uh, is the light on? What is happening? Okay, I don't know why it's... Okay. Is there, is there butter? Oh, what is the marmalade? Oh, they give you like some free stuff, guys. Like marmalade, which is basically jam. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think I'll take one. 
Then yeah, like a standard bathroom, shower. Yeah, nothing out of the ordinary except for the bidet, which, yeah, like that. <laughs> yeah, I have zero relationship with the bidet. And um, yeah, so that's just about that. I'm just gonna freshen up a wee bit and then go hit the city. Okay, so we just came back from freshening up. Right now in Heruskun, <laughs> we're in Kilista village. And so as you can see, like the cars here, they drive in the correct way. <laughs> like they keep left and pass right, um, like God intended. <laughs> but right now we are in Marabastad. Yeah. Uh, or, Mara or small streets, depending on which, whichever one you know, call it. And then I think they have like Christmas lights set up. Obviously, they'll probably be on later. No, like later. Oh, are they on? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, they are on. It's just, you know, it's not dark enough to, to see. But right now, we are headed towards that needle thing. I don't know what it's called. <laughs> it's just the needle monument thing. You guys, like, look at how beautiful these buildings look. And, um, yeah, like, you can... Apparently, it's a thing to grab her boob. I don't know, because I've, I've been seeing people cupping a seal. And I don't understand what that's about. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, no, no problem. <laughs> oh, my God. I just think, like, we just finished fondling this other woman, which is so unfortunate. Because, apparently, it's a tradition that you do when you're here. I don't know. So, good luck. Trinity College is a must-visit destination for those seeking to explore the story of not only Dublin as a city, but Ireland as a nation. Its history spans over 400 years. As such, it is Ireland's oldest university, which has educated some of Ireland's most respected public figures, including writers, politicians, and Nobel Prize winners. I'll include a link in the description below so that you can read more on it and understand why you should check it out. library okay and then so over there they have like the grounds you can go play quidditch <laughs> you know i really can't fault dublin but their public transport is yeah no it's not it especially once you start leaving the city center you will struggle low. um yeah it's a very historic City, I'll say. Like, okay, I don't know if you can go inside. You probably have to pay, and ugh, I don't do things that you have to pay for. So basically, um, as you see it now, it's supposed to be some kind of replica for the original, which was something like that. So the time of this recording. They have free admission. So right now, guys, welcome to my crib and TV. Just want to show you guys around because <laughs> we live in these um, royal parliaments. Okay. Castle. Okay, I'm not gonna do a full castle tour in this video because this video would become too long, and I'm trying to avoid that. But if you do go here and you find that the admission is still free, definitely check it out. I don't know how much it is if. It's not free, but um, it's definitely worth a visit. You can go in and read up on some of the stuff in there, which is quite interesting. And you can learn a lot more about Ireland that way. <laughs> ah. So for dinner, we find, we decide, yeah, eh? Oh, thanks. Because the robots are gone. Yeah. The robots are busy. The robots are Yes, my cooking. We love their hiring. Where did we just eat? <laughs> yeah, so like. Oh! So, we just ate. Yeah, huh? 
<laughs> well, like, like, we literally need to like take a walk to like yeah, help to digest it. some of the chicken and just to add ne? <laughs> so you were so excited if you don't order like half the chicken and we couldn't finish it yeah. and nah, that's what happiness looks like facts the very very sauce get out Happy guys. Okay, so at the moment, we're standing in the line. I guess. So we're gonna stand in this long ass line because um, Glow wants to drink some Guinness. But yeah, this is like um, Temple Bar Zone. What is this? I don't know. We're going clubbing with like chicken. <laughs> Yeah, so basically we're going clubbing to a pub with like some chicken because yeah, that's the level that we had. <laughs> clubbing with chicken and some chicken. So at this stage we were really tired and ready to get some shut eye for the day. And this is well end day one of this trip. Be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. Turn on those notifications so that you don't miss any future updates and share with friends so that we grow this community of budget travelers.